Hey guys, how's it going? New episode of the vlog. Have some cool stuff planned this weekend. I'm pretty sure, like I'm 90% sure, the stuff that I have going on in my head will happen. So I'm really looking forward to that. But first, but first, I think I need a haircut. My hair's getting a little long. What do you guys think? Yeah, all right, I'm gonna go get a haircut. I'm gonna do that first. All right, just got a fresh haircut. What do you guys think? Yay? Nay? Anyway, so, what do you say we get this weekend started? Let's go. Just picked up this tripod, hopefully to help out with some shots for the vlog. Uh, it was kind of cheap, it was like 10 bucks, the little legs bend. Uh, I'm not sure how I feel about it. Uh, when the phone's in it, it's definitely much more top heavy. Um, do you guys have any recommendations for tripods or inexpensive tripods? It's not like I need something super expensive, uh, but something that's sturdy. Um, if you guys have a recommendation, why don't you leave it in the comments down below? Thanks. Meeting some friends at this place called my parents' basement for lunch. Uh, I like the combo of things we have going on on this on this uh, billboard right here. So pull up. That's Sean. <laughs> Sean is a big fan of beer. Let's see if we can grab one. They've got this pretty awesome mural painted on the side of the building here. Until you get to the Denver International Airport mural. Yes. Yeah, Pretty cool graphic novels, trade paperbacks, and some Funko Pops here. New comic wall over here. I like the Star Wars Funko Pops they have up on the, the uh, shelf up there. That's pretty cool. I might have a couple of those. But right under that shelf, they have a lot of really cool old arcade games. Check this one out. They have a whole bunch of old, really cool vintage comic books back here behind the counter. It's pretty awesome. <laughs> yes, I have famously huge turns. I kind of want this Star Wars mural for my mantle. Do you want to know how I got these stars? I ended up getting the hamburger with the Tetris tots that actually have Tetris shapes to them. Look at that. They have a lot more toys up on this shop as well. There's Stonecutter Homer. Who rigs every Oscar night? We do. This place was pretty good. Definitely gonna come back and check it out. Check it out if you're in Atlanta. Red cat pillow. Stopped off at the secondhand store and they have a cat up for adoption. His name is Bagley. If, so if you follow all this information, you feel like you want to adopt Bagley, uh, get in contact with these people right here. Yeah. Hey, Bagley. Well, it's the next day. We had some fun going around Atlanta. Saw some cool spots. But today's Mother's Day. I'm going to take my mom out to lunch. And uh, we're going to see what the rest of the day holds. I get up for one minute to go get some coffee, and somebody stole my spot. What are you doing, Ziggy? You being a good boy? You know how I know you're being a good boy? Because you didn't steal my spot on the couch. Good boy. 
I bought this receiver from a friend of mine not too terribly long ago. The only problem with it is that it doesn't have a phono output for me to play my turntable. I can, but the volume is really low and I have to crank it up. So I uh, invested in one of these little guys, a little preamp, so that way I can connect it to my receiver, run the turntable through it, and I don't have to crank up the volume to listen to my records. So we're probably going to hook that up here in a few minutes. The name of the brand of preamp that I got is Pile. I don't have any experience with any Pile equipment, but I ended up getting some pretty good Amazon reviews, and ultimately I'm just kind of wanting louder volume on my records, so I didn't have to dive in too too much with a, an expensive preamp. Because uh, sometimes these preamps can go to like three, four hundred bucks. This guy was like 20 bucks after shipping, so we'll, we'll see. Taking it out of the box, it doesn't look like it's very big. Here, I'll put a, uh, a Nintendo Switch controller right next to it for scale, so not very big. Let's check it out. So to give you guys an idea of how low the volume is before the preamp is hooked up, this is what it's like. And this is what it sounds like with the preamp hooked up. Well, I can definitely hear my records a lot better. Uh, remember, I had to go all the way to like the high 30s and the low 40s just to start hearing stuff out of my speaker. After I hooked this guy up, I could start hearing stuff out of my speakers between 20 and 25 on the volume mark. So it's definitely worth the investment for what I need it for. So uh, yeah, thumbs up to this little preamp. Hey, I was going to sit here. It's okay, don't move. Why are my cats always taking my seat? Hello. Hey, say hi to my vlog, Mom. Hey, vlog. <laughs> <laughs> it's Mother's Day, and we're going to go get some Mother's Day lunch. Yay. You hungry, Mom? Yes, I am. All right, let's go. Real hungry. I stopped off at a Walmart on the way home, and, and what the hell is this? Like, why is this thing a thing that exists? Why? Hey guys, back at the house. Um, had, had Mother's Day lunch with my mom. I didn't film much, or I didn't film anything actually. It was just me hanging out with my mom. So I was just, just having some mom time. Um, but we had a pretty fun weekend. We went a whole bunch of cool places. So that's going to do it for this vlog. Um, I do want to say, I want to give a shout out and a big thank you to everybody who watched my first vlog. It has something like 85, 90 views. I didn't think I was gonna get like 20, but it's been shared and people have been subscribing and people have been really cool and enjoy it. So thank you guys for taking the time to watch my vlog. I really appreciate that. It means a lot to me. Uh, just cause I, I started this thing as a lark. Like I wanted something creative to do and I figured I had the means to do this. So I went for it. And you guys seem to be into it, so thanks a lot. I really appreciate it. And I kind of hope you stick around for some of the other vlogs that I get to do. Um, I have some cool things in mind, nothing solidified just yet, but hopefully I can uh, come up with some cool stuff that you guys will be interested in. But uh, until then, you know, I appreciate you hanging around and watching, and uh, we'll see you real soon. Take it easy.